successive integration successive successive integration this successive integration is very very important for joint entrance exam for short cut rule shortcut rule this is using successive integration we can use in any mcq type questions that is any je questions or type of je questions for shortcut rule and which is very very important for engineering students also engineering student engineering students and this is the this integral this is this procedure is integral integral u v dx this u and v both are the function of x where u is the function of x and v is the function of v is the function of another function of x and this in successive integration is alternate plus minus and starting from first function u multiplied by v one minus where u is the u is the first function u is the taking u is the first function u is the first function and v v is the second function that is u is first function first function and v is second function and this will be used as ilet rule i l a t e where where ilet is stand for i stand for inverse inverse function and l is logarithmic function logarithmic function and a is algebraical function algebraical function and t is trigonometrical function trigonometrical function and e is stand for exponential function exponential function according to this ilet rule we choose first function u and v is second function so this successive integration will be start from alternating it will be start from plus and alternating plus minus u v1 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 minus u dash dash plus u dash v her minus dot 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 and so on now with the help of an example we illustrate this successive integration example is example is the example is now we illustrate example then students will be clear the successive integration method example example one example is integral x cube sin x dx this integration you can done also integration by parts ibp but using ibp integration by parts this is very very long process many steps will be but using successive integration the value of this function x cube sin x will be easily done and only is one step and is will be i let 
I let here a is x cube here a is x cube and t is sin x here a is x cube and t is sin x so according to a is the first therefore taking x cube as a first function that is u this is will be u first function and this is v second function therefore first function starting from plus and integral of second function integral of second function that is minus cos x this is the integration of second function that is sin integration of sin x will be minus cos x and next will be minus derivative of x cube that is 3 x square and here will be integration of this minus cos x that is minus sin x and next step is plus minus next step is plus derivative of 3x square that is 6x and here is integration of this step that is minus minus cos x and next step is plus minus plus next step is minus and here derivative of 6x is 6 derivative of 6x is 6 and integration of cos x is sin x and next step is plus minus plus and derivative of 6 is 0 and here integration of sin x is minus cos x so here stop successive integration is stop because here derivative of 6 is 0 that is the total value is 0 therefore stop not going we have seen in the formula integral u v dx u v minus u dash v plus u v triple dash and minus dot dot so on therefore where here where where u dash is represents represents derivative this dash represents here derivative and v suffix represents integration okay so therefore here u is x cube here u is x cube and minus cos x is the integration of sin x that is v1 is sin cos x and next v double dash is the integration of v1 and v3 dash is the integration of v2 therefore this is the integration of minus cos x and this is the integration of minus sin x and minus cos x is the integration of sin x and so on will be going and 3x square is the derivative of x cube 6x x is the derivative of 3x square and 6 is the derivative of 3x square and 0 is the derivative of x square and so on going therefore this is the successive integration so the answer is after simplification minus x cube cos x plus 3x square sin x minus plus 6x cos x minus 6 sin x this is your required answer this is the integral value of integral x cube sin x dx this is the procedure of integration so students do yourself a sum integral e to the power 2x sin 5x dx 
and answer is e power 2x e power 2x by 29 to sin 5x minus 5 cos 5x plus c where c is the integrating constant so don't forget students to subscribe this channel for upcoming video lectures and press like and click on the bell icon.